As a person with ADHD, I have tried literally every single digital organization tool there is on the planet. Trello, Notion, Asana, ClickUp, you name it. And absolutely none of them work for me. And I figured out the exact reason why. And if you have ADHD, you probably understand how difficult it is to make these tools work. And you might not realize why. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna tell you why they don't work for me. So with ADHD, I'm easily distracted. I'm constantly seeking dopamine backed activities. And where would the absolute worst place be to keep track of all of your tasks? Well, on a device specifically designed to distract you. So whether that's your desktop computer or your phone when i pick up my device when i open my computer it's so easy to hop on facebook to hop on reddit to hop on twitter to hop on youtube just look up a particular item that i, I might be interested in buying or to hop on a chat and and talk to somebody about something it's so easy to get distracted and as somebody with adhd i absolutely thrive on routine so the only way that i've found to be able to keep myself organized is by using tactics that don't allow me to get distracted. And I've said it in like 20 other videos, but it's this good old fashioned notebook. And let me explain why. Go to my computer, I hop on it, very easy to be distracted. The notebook, there's not a lot of things to distract me. And I know that when I get to my desk in the morning, whether it's at my home office or at my actual desk office in the office that I drive to, that the first thing that I'm gonna do when I get there is not turn on my computer and look at all my messages. Now, the first thing that I do is I open my book, I flip to the last page, which was yesterday, and I look if there's anything that I didn't finish. I write those on a new day or a new page with today's date, and then I open up Slack and I open up email and I look at the text messages on my phone and if there was anything that people requested from me, I write it in the book. If somebody sent me something in the morning before I got to work, I'm gonna mark that message as unread so that when I go to re review everything in the morning that it's all very easy for me to find and I don't have to dig around. I don't think everything that comes in is not gonna be sitting in my head like another browser tab waiting to be dealt with. Put all these things down in this book and like I said, my routine is very simple. I come in, I look at this, I organize it into a Eisenhower matrix, I mark anything that might have a deadline, and then I start working through it. At the end of the day, when you look back, how many times have you, or at least for me, I've looked back and be like, what did I do all day today? But when you have everything written down and you scratch it off, you're like, wow, I actually did quite a bit of stuff. So you feel good about it. You get a bit of a dopamine feedback loop. And if you finish enough stuff early on, you know, then you can reward yourself with uh, one of the tasks that you enjoy doing. Anyways, I'm rambling here. My point being, at the end of the day, digital organization tools do not work for me as somebody, as somebody with ADHD. Nothing against these tools. I'm sure they're great for other people. But for me, sitting down at my desk, working through all the things that I need to do, writing them down, and then between tasks, making sure that I review them and write anything else that's come in over the day. If you like the video, 